Field is on gate. They're off, born to fight left for the lead. Out in the center of the track is Swish and Flick on the far outside. That is Cadabra's new recruits. Then will touch and from the inside is Explosive Day saving ground early on. Farther back of the field is Bob and Tony, then Rocket Master and the trailer is Time Will Tell All. They reach the top of the stretch the first time and with the lead, that is Swish and Flick. Swish and Flick has the lead. Going off stride at the top of the stretch was Cadabra's new recruit. Pulling the pocket, though, Mark McDonald and Born to Fight. Born to Fight looking to uh, fight for that lead in third is Explosive Day. It's two and a half back to Stemmel, touch fourth. Bob and Tony trots in fifth. Length and a half back to Rocket Master, three clear of Time Will Tell All. And now it's a long way back to Cadabra's new recruit. Opening quarter mile was trot in 30 seconds flat. They head to the back stretch. It's Born to Fight who leads the way at three to one. Born to Fight, a length and a half up on Swish and Flick. It's a length back third to Explosive Day. Then the Invader Stemmel touch in fourth. Four and a half lengths from the lead just outside the half mile. Then it's Bob and Tony and Dubay. And then comes Rocket Master and time will tell all. They want a half mile in one minute flat. 30 seconds in the second quarter. Moving on the paddock turn the second time. Born to fight. Leads it here a length and a half with Swish and Flick not far behind. It's a length and a half back third to Explosive Day and Oivan Hegdell. Kept close to these leaders. Next and fourth as they reach the top of the stretch. The second time is Stemmel touch. Bob and Tony hugs the cones in fifth. Andy Miller moves to the outside with Rocket Master. Six lengths to bridge this gap. And then comes time will tell all. Far behind after the miscue as they get to the three-quarter point has been Cadabra's new recruit. Three quarters, 130 and two. A 30 and two, very soft third quarter as they approach the back stretch with Born to fight who's uncontested to the back stretch, leading it by a length and a half. Swish and Flick is right there, all over the helmet of Mark McDonald. And on the outside is Stemmel Touch, born to fight, very vulnerable now. Stemmel Touch now brings the pressure on the outside. Toward the inside, it's Swish and Flick third. And Andy Miller trying to rally Rocket Master with time ticking away. Explosive day on the inside, wide open affair. The mile was two minutes flat. Final turn on the outside. Stemmel touch toward the inside. Born to fight. Swish and Flick looks to crank it up toward the inside. Nowhere to go. Explosive day. Then Rocket Master travels between horses into the stretch. And Swish and Flick on the outside is taking the lead. Stemmel touch second. And on the inside, it's explosive day. But drawing away, Jim Rohn Jr. and Swish and Flick to win by six. Stemmel touch second. In for third was Bob and Tony. And then time will tell all an explosive day.